your damn radio, so I had time to kill the rock you. Anyway, let me look that up here. Hey, it's Johnny Jones, and I'm here at home. Today I wanted to share something that I did that um, I probably should have made a video of before, but don't worry, they'll have more of these in the future, I think. Basically, what I did is I did my first mod, radio modification. Uh, for all those people who don't know what mod means. <laughs> yeah, anyways. So, um, I... I Watch this uh, YouTube channel called Mike's uh, Radio Repair. I don't think he's uploaded in a long time, but you should check him out. He's pretty cool. And so he made me aware that I could actually make a noise blinker. Well, not a noise blinker. It's a tone control, basically. What it does is it shaves off static by... Before I show you that, I'll show you. Basically, all you need is a capacitor. I used a um, 0 0.68 microfarad capacitor you can get those for a buck on eBay and so this is my first job so it's gonna it's pretty horrible um, but I can say that the connections are good the connections there's no there's no issue with solder joints the solder joints are legitimately good but yeah, it looks kind of fucked up. Basically, what I've going, I've got going is is there's a capacitor in this this um, uh, heat shrink, and this is the ground, and then the other side of the capacitor is going to the uh, the volume control. Basically, what that does is it helps shave off noise. If you get too high of a microfarad capacitor then you'll start shaving too much of the voice off. So I got it on there. Now noise blinker. Let me change it. Noise blinker. Is on. Off. On. Off. On. So that's pretty noisy on its own, you can tell. I mean, that's wide open. That's pretty noisy on its own. That was double on the noise factor. beforehand and when I put that capacitor in line it was it was insane just the, the the amount of difference that I heard coming out of the speaker it went from this really high pitch ear screech like ear breaking screech because I got my computer running I have my uh, I have electronics running in the background I have um, I have my air conditioner on and all this so it was a lot of noise and uh change up and uh this sounds absolutely amazing it sounds like a premium radio that, that has the tone control that's all it is it's just a freaking capacitor connected to ground so it filters out uh, the signal now i know some people aren't gonna like how much I've reduced it. Some people might find it too much, some people might find it too little. But uh, you can just change the values. Um, like a 0 0.68, you could try up to a 1 or a 1.1 or maybe a 1 point, or 0 0.47. That's what um, Mike was talking about. But uh, I think it works well. I mean, I don't, I don't hear a massive amount of noise. I'm not getting, I'm not getting uh, people's voices cutting off. You know, they don't sound too bassy. Yeah, they don't sound like that. I can get the um, uh, some of the treble in their voice, mostly mids, but still. Works wonders. What I've been looking at is basically modifying radios and selling them. But uh, this will work on power as well. So it'll work on your um, power input at the back here. Not this specific capacitor. It could be, from what I hear, the bigger capacitor the better. But if you put it across, 
your positive and, and um, reference ground, you'll get a massive noise reduction from pa the you know your power supply. Which like if you're if you're like me and you have a Wii power supply, then you're gonna be okay anyway. I mean it's a regulated power supply, but if you're running in like a vehicle um, where there's a lot of static and noise from the engine, a capacitor across your um, positive and neg negative terminals. Uh, apparently will cut the noise down by a massive amount. If you pair that with this mod, um, I wouldn't go too high with the capacitor. I mean, this is, I don't know, this seems really, really, like, good. This, it seems like any more than this, any more noise reduction than this, that you start actually losing fidelity of the voice. If we can get back on here. So you haven't lost the trebles and the voices, and that's what I was aiming for. Uh, if I sound a little bit under the weather, it's because I've been under the weather my whole life. I've never been above the weather, that's for sure. That'd be weird. I'd be in outer space. Anyways, this is Johnny Jones. I'm here at home, and uh, I'll see you later.